Hi everyone, my name is Rushab and today we are going to learn a super feature in Excel called Goal Seek. It comes under what if analysis. Let's take a simple example to understand this. So you're running a shop and you give somebody an invoice of a thousand dollars. On that, the government levies two kind of taxes. The first one is 10% on the thousand dollars, which comes up to a hundred dollars. And the second tax is on top of that first tax, which is 5%. So that comes to $5 on that $100. Now the total amount is coming up to $1,105. Now you give this invoice to your customer and he asks you for a discount. He's a loyal customer. You don't want to deny him. He asks you for a discount. So it's so as to the total amount should be $1,000. Now that's a lot. So you are not able to give him that much discount. Finally, after negotiations, you both come up to a final amount of $1,050. So how do you calculate the invoice amount to be exactly in a way that the invoice amount plus tax one plus tax two should be equal to $1,050? So basically, here is where you need the $1,050 by changing the invoice amount. Why only the invoice amount? Obviously, you cannot change the tax 1% or the tax 2%. So what you have in hand is only to change the invoice amount. So let's do this using goal seek. First, I will click on my total amount. That is $1,105. I will go to the data tab what if analysis and click on goal seek in set cell i will keep my total amount to value i will keep 1050 because that's what we need by changing with cell invoice amount now let me remind you that if you had to do this manually you had to do a back calculation owing to the percentages which cannot be changed which is going to take some time now this using goal seek is going to give you the answer in a split second. Let's see. Press OK. Wow. So $950 plus 10% plus 5% of that is exactly $1,050. Super. If you're okay with this, press OK. If not, press cancel and your values will revert back. Thank you for watching.